Okay, so in this section of the guide, we're going to look at how to identify a research topic. Now, to do this, we're going to have a look at a broad research area, and then we're going to brainstorm this to find the key elements and then the sections that interest you the most. Uh, once we've brainstormed the idea out, uh, we're going to look at the key elements and the concepts to decide upon a refined topic area, and we'll use this refined topic area to create our research strategy. Easy. Okay, so here we go with step one, which is identifying your research area. Now, as part of your coursework, you're going to be asked to write a lit review that will discuss the advantages and disadvantages of one of the different methodologies involved in paramedic work. Now, this could involve the development of pre-hospital practices in pain relief, in mental health, uh, or how a particular method or technique is come and gone from daily practice in the paramedic life. All right. So in this case, we're going to look at the history and the development of pre-hospital care for coronary patients, or more basically, how paramedic or pre-hospital care has developed when treating heart attack patients. Now, the first step here is to brainstorm the idea to refine the research topic. Okay, so when we're brainstorming, we need to start broadly, so with our main question, the history of paramedic care for coronary patients, and start to branch out in different angles to see what's available to us. Now, the easiest and most obvious place to go from here is the history of ambulance. So you could track the history of ambulance services in Australia or around the world. From the history of ambulance services, you can go to the developments of paramedic practice out of the history of ambulances, or you could go the other way into a history of pre-hospital medicine, which may be looking at wartime stuff or disasters. We could start again and go in different directions. So another way to go would be to look at the history of coronary care and how paramedics fit into this. So we can start with the history of coronary care, then we could branch out into developments in CPR, into things like mobile defibrillation, and then into pre-hospital diagnosis. So how paramedics have helped medicine, help doctors with their diagnosis of heart attack patients. Finally, we can look more broadly at bigger topics. We could look at things like developments in pre-hospital diagnosis. We could look at treatments for myocardial infarction. We could look at ECGs and how they've changed things. We could even look at stabilizing patients in the pre-hospital environment, so how patient transport has changed over time. Now, once you've done all these things and thought about them a little, you start to get a list. And here we have a big list of the key ideas. And from these key ideas, we can start to narrow down our research topic to create our lit review. Okay. So now that we have our list of key ideas from the brainstorming, well, we can start to develop our search strategies. Then what we do to develop a search strategy is to look at our key ideas and then break this down again into the key concepts. So if we're going to look at the history of coronary care, we need to look at things like CPR, defibrillation, stance, heart massage, different medications, different diagnosis. And as we're pre-hospital technicians or paramedics, we have to look at these terms as well. So using these terms and our key ideas, we can start to create some search strategies by combining a few terms together and seeing what they look like. So you can start to look for things like pre-hospital and coronary care and history to get the history of coronary care in pre-hospital situations. Then do the same for CPR. Then maybe have a look for diagnosis with paramedic and then different methods, or then pre-hospital and coronary care and defibrillation for history. Now any or all of these search strategies will start to get you results that you can start to use for your literature review. Okay, so hopefully by following through with this, you've figured out um, your research area. You're going to identify your topic, you've brainstormed it out, Divide, identified the key terms of concept and begun creating your research strategy. In the next section, we'll go through research in a lot more detail. All right, good luck.